Canva has just made presentations even more easier now with the new feature of appear on click. So every time you click a mouse on your page, something will change. Would it be the words? You can highlight an answer. You can add a video. All very simply by just clicking your mouse within the same page without moving hyperlinks and all that stuff. So let's go over to Canva and explore how to do this. So I have these two slides already made and what I did was put what I want on these slides right here. I wanna change this button to green when say you ask a class and they answer and they're like, oh, true, true. And then you wanna make it turn green. So I'm gonna duplicate this real quick. I am going to go into edit. I'm gonna go into dual tone. I wanna to pick out a green. And then what I'm gonna do is go into position and put it where I want it, right there. And then what you can do is go into animate and then click on appear on click. So what happens there is when you start your presentation, it's gonna, this green one is not gonna show until you click. So let's say I want this to come in afterwards. So I'm gonna go appear on click and then you can go in here to your order. So I don't want that to come off first. So it's just like your layers tab. So you wanna do it in order of which way you want it to click. So you want the green to appear on the click, first click, and then you want on your next click for the little animation here to pop off. So we have that set up like that, and it's just like your layers tab. Top is gonna to be your first click, then, then your succession is gonna go down as, as your clicks go down. So let's go to the other page. So what I wanna do is I wanna duplicate this because if you know me, match and move is my groove. I am gonna go and change the text to a green. And then what I wanna do is I'm gonna do this video in here too. So you can do video. There's a workaround we've been doing, but now you can do video on click. So what I wanna do is I wanna put this over here for a minute so I can grab all of these like so. And then I'm gonna go over to animate. I'm gonna put my click on up here, and then I'm gonna go in the order that I want them. So I want this, my video to come up last. So I want that at the bottom. I want my green one to be at the bottom because I want my answers to come up and, I, and make sure your answers, the way you want them to show up are in whatever order you want them to be. So now that you have them in order, you have that all set up, easy peasy lemon squeezy, now I'm going to go on the positions tab and I'm going to move that up front. So your position tab is different than your animate tab, your click. So that doesn't matter. This is not going to match your one in your click. Your click is your order versus how you want these to set up and be looked at. If that makes sense. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go over to presentation and we're going to go and present. So what I want to do is I'm going to start off, oops, not on this first page. We're going to start off, this is the second page. Let's start off on the first page. Michelle makes cool designs. Well, I think I do. So that is true. And everybody, true, yes. And I click and there it's true. And then I want the little animation to go off. So I'm going to click again. There goes my animation. And when I click for the third time, it will go to the next page. What does Michelle use most in Canva? Duotone. Match and move, shadows, or transitions. So the answer to that is, of course, match and move. So when I click, match and move will turn green. And then I was like, oh, there's a little video. Let's click again. And there goes my video. And here's my video with sound. And my little chihuahua and me sound, talking baby to my little chihuahua. And that is how easy that is. So it takes out a lot of, um, I was doing hyperlinks. So that can eliminate a lot of hyperlinks and different pages if you wanna go that route and timing. So that cuts out a lot where you can just go in there and just go in here and go into your animate. We don't want the page animate. Go into animate and look at your order and just, how you want them to come in. And then all you gotta do is click the page and they will come in as you click the page. So much easier because timing, yes, timing is awesome, but sometimes monotonous, especially if you're 
talking or you have a voiceover or something going on. So say you had a, this video was a voiceover or you're talking in a little video in the corner here and you want this to come up. So you would have this on the top and then you'd want these to come in next. So if we go into present, now I'll go into present, I can click, my video will pop up and say I was saying I was talking and then as I hit those words, I can click. So I can click as the words are being said. And then if the answer pops up, I can also click and hit that answer. So I'm just clicking my page and all of this is coming up at one time. Super easy, makes life super, super awesome and easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And I hope you learned a little something from this because I think this is an awesome new feature. And I'm glad y'all stopped by. And you know what? I love you guys. You have any questions or find any new things you can do with this, please leave them in the comments. If they're good, I'm going to pin them to the top or make a group thing with all the newfangled things. As I said before, I love you. I will see you on the next one. Bye, y'all.